Black diamonds, often referred to as carbonado, are among the most mysterious and rare forms of diamond found on Earth. Unlike traditional white diamonds that are transparent and brilliant, black diamonds are opaque, polycrystalline, and filled with inclusions that give them their dark color. Because treated or synthetic stones are frequently passed off as natural black diamonds, proper testing is essential. One of the most effective ways to identify a real black diamond is by examining it under a microscope. Bummer. 1. Preparing for the test. Before placing the stone under a microscope, several steps are necessary to ensure accurate observation. Cleaning the stone. Use warm, soapy water and a soft brush to remove any dirt, grease, or polishing residues. A clean surface helps avoid mistaking debris for natural inclusions. Choosing the right microscope. A gemological microscope or a stereo microscope with magnification from 10 times up to 60 tabs or more is ideal. Some gemologists also use polarizing microscopes to study internal structures in more detail. Lighting setup. Both overhead, reflected, and side lighting are important. Black diamonds are opaque, so transmitted light is less useful than in clear diamonds. NADAR 2. Low magnification observation, 10 types to 20 times. At the initial stage of observation, focus on the general appearance. Opacity. A real black diamond is completely opaque, even under strong light. If you notice areas of translucency, the stone may be dyed or a simulant. Surface texture. Natural carbonado often has a granular or porous surface, instead of the smooth, glassy texture common in imitations. Shape and habit. Many rough black diamonds do not show sharp, well-formed crystal shapes like transparent diamonds. Instead, they may look irregular or rounded. Number three, medium to high magnification, 30 kinds to 60 kinds. At higher magnifications, you can begin to notice the unique internal features of black diamonds. Polycrystalline structure. Unlike single crystal white diamonds, black diamonds are composed of many small diamond crystals fused together. This gives them a distinctive aggregate appearance under magnification. Porosity. Look for tiny holes, pores, and cracks spread across the surface and inside the stone. These are natural features of carbonado. Inclusions. Real black diamonds contain numerous graphite inclusions and sometimes traces of other minerals. These inclusions scatter light, making the stone appear dark. Texture differences. The interior will often appear mottled or uneven rather than clean and uniform. Number four, checking the luster and reflection lighting is key in this step. Metallic submetallic shine. Authentic black diamonds often have a slightly metallic or dull luster rather than the bright glassy shine of fake stones. Coatings and dyes. Under oblique light, treated or coated stones may reveal thin surface films, polish marks, or even flaking layers. These are signs of artificial treatment rather than natural origin. Number five, examining edges, fractures, and surfaces. Natural growth lines. Genuine black diamonds often show irregular growth lines, pits, or cracks. Artificial treatments. Fake stones sometimes reveal smooth, even fractures or colored coatings applied to make them look black. Surface consistency. If only the surface appears black but chips or scratches reveal a lighter color beneath, the stone has likely been dyed. Number six, additional microscopic techniques. For more advanced examinations, gemologists often use cross-polarized light. This can highlight internal stress patterns and help detect the crystalline structure. Raman microscopy, a very reliable test that confirms the diamond's atomic structure and can detect graphite inclusions typical of carbonado. Scanning electron microscopy, SEM, useful for research level analysis, revealing the stone's porous structure in extreme detail. Number star seven, common mistakes and misidentifications. Confusing coatings with natural features. Some synthetic or treated stones are coated with black material to mimic carbonado. Under magnification, coatings often appear as separate layers. Over-reliance on one feature. A real test should combine observations opacity, inclusions, texture, and luster, rather than depending on a single characteristic. Skipping professional verification. While a microscope can provide strong evidence, only a certified gemological laboratory can issue a conclusive identification report. Shashnadankar 8, professional confirmation. If the stone is valuable or if there is any doubt, send the diamond to a gem lab, such as GIA, SSEF, or IGI. Labs use advanced tools like Raman spectroscopy, photoluminescence, and X-ray diffraction for absolute certainty.
Conclusion Testing a real black diamond under a microscope is one of the most effective ways to distinguish natural carbonado from imitations. Key signs include complete opacity, polycrystalline structure, porous surfaces, and graphite inclusions. While these features strongly indicate authenticity, advanced testing or professional certification is always recommended for stones of significant value. Black diamonds may lack the brilliance of transparent diamonds, but under the microscope, they reveal a fascinating and complex structure that makes them truly unique among gemstones.